In today's video, we're gonna take you on a walkthrough tour of a quick move-in townhome available here in the Cadence at Tradition gated community within Port St. Lucie, Florida. The townhome behind me is a three bedroom, two and a half bathroom with 1,751 square feet under air. This is the Dakota floor plan, and it has a two car garage, which is unique for townhomes in this area. And throughout today's video, we're gonna go over all the details of the townhome, We'll go over the builder incentives that are currently available for this particular one. I'll go over the price of the townhome. We'll go over the HOA fees, what's included in your monthly HOA, all the amenities. We'll go over the CDD fees and property taxes and other important information about the tradition area in general. And if you're new to my channel, my name is David Rogers. I am a licensed real estate broker. And if you're looking to move to Port St. Lucie, Florida or the surrounding areas, I encourage you to call me, text me, or shoot me an email anytime. Just a reminder, it doesn't cost you a penny to hire us as your realtor. The builders and sellers pay all of our commissions. Doesn't cost you a penny to use us. And without further ado, let's get started on today's walkthrough tour of the Dakota Quick Move-In Townhome located here in Cadence at Tradition. So let's get started with the monthly homeowner association fees. On the townhome models, they're gonna be $338 a month. That's gonna cover your outside irrigation, yearly pest control. It's gonna cover the amenities here, which they have a community pool, a waiting pool. They're going to have a covered cabana, not a clubhouse, but we'll go over more details at the end of the video when we talk about the builder incentives and everything else you need to know. So make sure you stick to the end of the video to help hear more about the whole community and everything else in today's video. So all the townhomes here have a two car garage. In between each townhome is CBS block construction. So that's going to be more, it's going to offer more privacy. It's going to be quieter, more insulated than a lot of townhomes out there that have the wood frame construction on the second floor. But these are concrete block construction in between and the exterior walls are all concrete, concrete block construction. All the windows and exterior doors, if they're glass, are going to be hurricane impact resistant. Now, what's a little different about the townhome section compared to the rest of Cadence at Tradition, everything here is gonna be electric. There is no gas available with the townhomes. The exterior front door is gonna be eight foot high. Again, these are hurricane impact rated glass, but the doors are eight foot high. So let's head inside and tour the rest of the townhome. So just a reminder, this is a quick move-in townhome ready to go. It's currently priced at $357,430, but there are some great incentives that you can use to lower the price. And I'll go over that at the end of the video. So this townhome has carpet downstairs and carpet upstairs. This does have the cashmere B design package. What is the design package? So if you haven't watched any of my other videos, make sure I'll put a link in the description below to watch the detailed community tour of Cadence at Tradition. So the Cashmere B package is gonna come with these color cabinets and it'll have the wood plank tile floor. This is the B package. This is called Cashmere B. It gives you the quartz countertops. This is gonna be included in the package. The upper cabinets, these are 42 inch. It has crown molding. This townhome is gonna to come with a refrigerator. It will come with the stove or range or the stove and oven that will be included. Again, this is a quick move in townhome that'll be ready pretty much any day now. Another thing to point out, a lot of people ask me, so in Cadence at Tradition, the microwaves do not vent outside. Again, they do not vent outside. Another view of the living room area. Again, hurricane impact windows and doors. The rear sliding glass doors, these are eight foot high. It does have a covered lanai. I will take you outside and show you one unique feature and aspect about this community that you're not gonna find with any of the other townhome communities 
out there. So you got a half bathroom downstairs. This is a large half bathroom. This is gonna be a pantry area off of the kitchen area. Plenty of room. Again, it's got a two car garage. So again, another thing to point out, again, I said it before, so the townhomes are gonna be electric. Everything's gonna be electric. You're gonna have an electric water heater. Does have a garage door opener. It's gonna be a lift master. And if you're enjoying today's video, please take the time to smash that like button, hit, give it a thumbs up and leave comments. And if you haven't done so, make sure you subscribe to my channel so that you get notified when more videos come out just like this one. So this townhome already has the LED package and the two extra lights, this one and this one, that's called the pendant lighting. So that's where you could buy your own chandeliers or any fancier pendant lighting that you wanna hang here. So let's go upstairs. Again, so this townhome, this is the way you would buy it. The builder's not gonna allow any changes at this point. So just keep that in mind. Again, carpet upstairs. This is like a bonus, it's like a bonus room. It could be like a little living room area. It's an extra area that you could set up some furniture. Got your AC unit here. Washer dryer. So I believe this one, they're going to include the washer dryer, which normally they do not. Now you got your owner's bedroom here. And these rooms are actually a lot larger in person. I have a couple other clients that are under contract in Cadence at Tradition as we speak. And the first thing they say when they do show up is the rooms are bigger than what the video shows it as. The interior doors, these doors are six foot, eight inches. Some builders or some communities will have eight foot doors. But this community, you're getting a larger square footage of a home or property for a little bit more affordable price. So they do have to make changes in different areas. Again, hurricane impact windows and doors. How you tell if you bang on the window and it sounds solid, then you know it's impact. Now let's look across here. You can fence in your backyard. You actually have a good size backyard to fence in on every one of the townhome floor plans here. That's what makes it unique compared to most townhomes. Now upstairs, you're gonna have the same wood plank tile flooring in the bathrooms. You're gonna have the same color cabinets, the same countertops. Again, these are quartz countertops. Nice size walk-in shower. Make it a better view for you. It's got a nice transom window up there as well. And gives you a look at the tile floor. Another little linen closet. It's a decent size by all means. And here's your walk-in closet. And again, this is a good size walk-in closet. This will be your standard shelving with pretty much every builder out there. That's something if you wanna upgrade after the fact, which a lot of people do. But again, this is a good size walk-in closet. Another view of the bathroom. You got your head toilet over here. Another view of the owner's bedroom. Here's another view of that room when you come up the stairs. This is a good size. So you can definitely put a little sofa here. Maybe another little TV somewhere. Here's bedroom number two. And again, if you need more information, just remember, reach out to me. I can get you all the information you need. 
And make sure that you call me before you plan a trip to Port St. Lucie, Florida, so I can be with you during your visit when you decide to look at new construction homes. We have to be here on the initial visit. Closet. Check out the other bathroom. So again, remember, Cadence at Tradition is offering what's called design packages. So you'll see the same cabinets, countertops, tile floor, same thing with the, the subway tile here in the bathroom. Here's bedroom number three. So the way you see this townhome is the way you're gonna get it. They do not come with window treatments, no blinds, no shades, nothing like that. All that you would have to install after closing. That's gonna be the same closet as in the other bedroom. Now let's head downstairs. And again, if you're looking to move to Port St. Lucie, Florida, there's tons of different communities out there to consider. You have Cadence at Tradition, you got Kinley at Tradition, you got Bristol at Wilder, you have Seville at Tradition, you have Veranda Oaks, Veranda Gardens, you have Veranda Landings. There are so many different communities to consider if you're looking to move here to Port St. Lucie, Florida. Just call me, text me, or shoot me an email to learn more. Now, we're out back right now. Again, there's gonna be other townhomes built here behind the property, so keep that in mind. Now let's find where these stakes are at right here. I'm sure if you can see that right there. That's your property line, so this gives you an idea how big this actually is. There's plenty of room for a fence back here all day long. Now let's head back inside and go over the remainder of the details of this townhome and the community. And you got your covered lanai here. If you want to screen this in, you could definitely screen this in. So let's, let's go over and do a recap of today's walkthrough tour of this particular townhome that's for sale here in the Cadence at Tradition community. So this townhome currently is priced at $357,430. The builder is offering up to $20,000 in incentives or in incentives for this quick moving townhome. Now this video is being recorded on February 15th, 2024. This townhome could sell in a matter of days or weeks. They have other townhomes coming available for sale. So if you're thinking about buying one and you wanna go under contract, but let's say that you don't need to close for three months, four months, five months, there's other townhomes that would fit what you're looking for. Just call me, text me, email me. I work directly with the salespeople on a regular basis. Again, there's no incentive for you not to have a realtor. It doesn't cost you a penny and you're not gonna save any money by not bringing a realtor with you. So, 357,430, dollars $357, $430. The $20,000 incentive you can use towards closing costs. If you wanna buy down your interest rate, um, you can use the money any way you want. Now, if you're paying cash, you could use it just to lower the purchase price of the townhome which I would highly recommend for a couple reasons. It'll be better for your property taxes in the long run to keep your taxes a little bit lower. Now, that's something else to talk about while we're talking about property taxes. Property taxes are a big sore point for a lot of people that don't understand what they're getting themselves into when buying anything anywhere. So if you buy a property in Port St. Lucie, Florida, and let's say that you buy a place for $400,000. Let's just kind of keep this simple for now. Take $400,000 times it by 0 0.02. That'll give you $8,000 a year in property taxes. That is a rough estimate, pretty close to where the taxes would be for a $400,000 property. Now, if you buy a property for $350,000, 
figure around $7,000 a year. Regardless of what people tell you, if taxes will always seem lower on new construction because it hasn't been reassessed. So if you've owned a home before, you know all about what this means in most cases. Now, Cadence at Tradition does have what's called a CDD fee. If you're not familiar what a CDD fee is, CDD, fee, CDD fees are community development district fees. Any new community is gonna have it nine times out of 10. And here in Cadence at Tradition, the CDD fee for the townhome collection will be about $947 a year. So you would add that $947 to your property tax amount I just gave you a few seconds ago. The CDD fee will last about 30 years, so you pay for it yearly. If you look at new construction in a community and they say no CDD fees, do you really think that that's costing you nothing? What they do is they, just, they add it into the price of the property. So now you're paying more for the same property. That means your regular property taxes are a little bit more anyways. So just keep that in mind. Don't fall for that BS. Um, I'm very forthcoming and transparent on all my videos so that you're more informed before you decide of making your move here. I just want you to know what you're getting yourself into. Um, HOA fees. Let's kind of do a recap again. So the HOA fees or homeowner association fees are $338 a month here in Cadence at Tradition for the townhomes. There's different prices for the HOA fees depending on what you're in. That's going to cover your outside irrigation. So they're going to use the water from the lakes to irrigate your lawn. They're going to cover your sprinklers. They're going to cover your mulching, lawn cutting, and yearly pest control. I was told before pest control was included. I heard it was every couple months, every six months. Just figure it's going to be yearly outdoor pest control is what we're hearing. It's going to come with an alarm monitoring system. So if you live within tradition, tradition itself, the master HOA, if you can see right here, $199.28 a month. That's going to cover your high-speed internet, cable TV with HBO. It's going to cover an alarm monitoring system. Um, then the community for amenities wise, they have a community pool, a round wading pool. They're going to have a covered cabana, not a clubhouse. Not a clubhouse here, it's a covered cabana. For 338, you're gonna get less amenities compared to some of the other communities where it's $500 or more a month. This is a gated community, but it's not a man-gated community. It's a regular gate, they have little transponders or those um, barcode things on your car. That's how you're gonna get in and out or into the community. Mailboxes. There are no mailboxes in front of your property. They have centralized mailboxes near the entrance of the community. Another thing to point out too, what was I gonna say? I do this all the time. If you watch my videos and you're regular, I ramble on because I'm trying to remember everything. Um, how far are we from tradition? So we're in tradition, but if you wanted to go to like downtown tradition or tradition town center, the landings, that's where all the restaurants are at, the activities, the shopping, you're five, six, seven minutes away from tradition. Um, you're about 10 minutes away from I-95, you need to jump on the highway. You're about 40 minutes roughly to Jensen Beach. That's gonna be your closest beach to this area. It's a really nice beach. They got restaurants there, boutique shops. They do have a dog beach to the north in Hutchinson Island. So if you're ever looking on a map, look to the north of Jensen Beach. There's a public dog beach up there. There's a dog beach in Stewart. You could also go to Stewart Beach. If you want something a little different, go to Fort Pierce. They have this Fort Pierce State Inlet Park. These are just other stuff to do for outside adventures or something to take the kids if you want to go to the beach. Um, I know I'm missing something else. I do this in every video. Um, oh, builder incentives. So the builder incentives, if you're going to use the builder incentives, especially with financing, in order to get, you need to use the builder's title company and or builder's lender to take advantage of these incentives. Again, if you have questions, just call me, text me, email me. I can, I can answer all this. 
Um, if you want to know of any other communities of quick moving homes, get with me. Oh, so does, we talked about earlier about design packages. So these are what they call design packages. Again, watch my other video, the Cadence Community Tour or video. I'll put a link in the description below so you can watch that video to learn more about what the design packages are and everything about the community. Yeah, but again, I appreciate you watching the entire video. I know my videos are very long. I just try to give you the much information as possible in every single video because it gets overwhelming watching all these different walkthrough tours. And again, when you buy a quick moving home, this is the way you're getting it. You know what the price is, you know what to expect, but make sure before you come to Port St. Lucie, before you visit any of the builders, you need to make sure you have a realtor present with you to help negotiate the contracts. Our job is to get you the best deal. $20,000 in incentives is what they're telling us. Doesn't mean I can't get you a little bit more like I have for other clients that are under contract right now in Cadence at Tradition. So just keep that in mind. Again, my name is David Rogers. I'm a licensed real estate broker. I can help you with buying real estate, selling real estate, new homes, resell homes in Port St. Lucie as far down to Palm Beach County. So if you're looking at West Palm Beach, Loxahatchee, Boynton Beach, you name it, I can help you with in this region of Southeast Florida. And we will see you on the next video coming out real soon.